Yo, greetings and greetings and greetings and welcome to the breakdown with DJ Odyssey and no I'm DJ Odyssey always and today man um, I just want to do something special um, which I uh, started with when I started this tutorials anyway <clears throat> so I want us to to start the beat from scratch and work into it so that everyone can see how you actually do i'm a piano from scratch with me you know it might take a while but i'll try to edit some other things which i'll be using which will not be like like important you know so in this tutorial i'm also going to use my pack the link will be in my description anyway uh it's been out since friday uh some of you have gone as much as to get the sample pack and if you don't have the sample pack, please go down and just get the sample pack and then let's work, you know, um, without wasting time. And let's try to do this and see how it pans out. We we'll just try to do on my piano. I don't know which style we want to try and do, but let's just work and see uh, which brains are going to come when I'm working or anything. But I'm trying to get something soulful because I love these soulful sounds, you know. So I just want you all to see how it get to some point and i'm not trying to play the keyboard as much i want to just use my my mouse and everything and then so that everyone can can just get into it you know so let's not waste time man let's just get into it so let's get into the, the drums and then i have this i'm a piano drums samples in my in my in my thing so let's do this uh i'll put this at 113 and then i have these ones that you can actually start making beats with so yeah let's hear i'll use this um this will be very low so basically in this yamo piano packs you can just select them all actually and put them into into this these are for my piano uh, you can come up with a nice thing so we take it to one one thirteen right Let's put it at 113 and I'll reduce this and then and let's hear right and then I'll put this And then this sounds like a shaker. Mm, ah. I hope you're just watching and <laughs> learning something. And then for me, this sounds a little bit better. So it's pattern one. I like to just drag it and then maybe until 15th. Yeah. And then. excuse me so um the next thing after doing something like this maybe get like um a shaker i have shakers 
Um, just so you know, most of these are piano shakers for me here. They are normally uh, like here, at the, like most of them are like here at the bottom and then it's, it says 120. So you just make sure that you put it down 120 and you can just do that. And then let's see what else do we need to do. I like to normalize it a little and you can just reduce the volume and then let's see and also chop it here and then put more song. and then this sounds better a little and then what we need uh, so I'm not gonna put anything onto any any pattern or channel for now I will listen to it and then just work as we go. And then uh, let's try another pattern. And then, but I will come here into packs, uh, instruments, and then let's say keyboard. Then let's try this electric, electric piano. I actually shouldn't have deleted that. So let's do this insert. Let's say sampler. Yo, I'm looking for sampler. Uh, even if it's not a sampler, I'm gonna need for two. Okay, let's put sampler here. So it's at the top here. So it doesn't have a sound. That's where I'm trying to put ghost note so that I can put uh, the keyboard very well on it because um, we're looking for something so far. So what we're going to do is come here and then on these dotted lines, you're the stamp, we say major. And then we try to, let's say we're playing on uh, G, right? This is G. So we're playing a G major. So we you just drag these things to put them at every G G. So now the scale is G. And then these will be ghost notes. You know that uh when I play on G, this is where most of my notes are gonna be. So G, I think Let's do the last one. Great. So we have this, right? And then now you come here into this electric piano and then you try to make cuts, right? And so let's say it's on pattern two. We just put it here. Yeah, put it here. And then, so the good part is now whatever key you want to start at will have Let's hear something. So let's say I do that. So now you're on C. So if you choose C, so let's come to C here. And then now you just put this, you just jump one of these highlighted stuff. And then you say F sharp, F sharp, F sharp. And you can do this. And then. And then you're on A. You can even come as low as, you can even come to this low level of A. But just jump one. And then you are at E. Uh, 
C D E this is E right so you can so we only just put four notes and then can you hear how nice they sound so you just did this and then what you can do is come here maybe this two uh say con and you just put them high like that and then you can even take this and say control up arrow i think i like it like this maybe <laughs> have like some nice chords coming up on, on your song and then the next thing maybe you want to come here into uh we still on this instrument and then let's get into maybe uh legacy and then i think legacy has some instruments as well and then i see orchestra yeah you have this tenor sex here so you take the saxophone you put it in so what i'm trying to do is i'm trying to make sure that i'm using the sounds that you find in afro studio to actually find a nice uh to actually make good music without you trying to download like your purity and those type of things and then i'll try to make another tutorial i'll try to download some free plugins that i think would help me to to actually make good music and then i'll give you the links to to the free plugins so that everyone can actually use those ones and so now on this one so this is the phone so now we're trying to find we will try to find uh, a nice spot uh, to actually play saxophone you already know like the saxophone in, in my piano we use it mostly to get the bounce in the song and then i can just do this so i'll just play it like that and then so I say control b and then let's select everything and then change it to one over four and we will reduce these and as you can hear like you already have a nice summer piano jam and then um the next thing that you will try to do is i think i'm done with these type of songs oh still let's go into instruments and then i say orchestra I'll take a nice string let's say string section right uh what i'll do with the string here yeah, is play the same thing that's that's the co that the chords are playing right so let's sort of this down so we can try to mess with it a little So, but you don't want it to be a string string, but you want it to, the string to sound like you want the string to sound like it's a pet of some sort. So what you do is like have a slower like a slower attack. So take the attack up from the ADSL. So you come to zone. So so let's see how it starts, and then you increase the release a little so that it doesn't stop immediately it doesn't stop when the string stops so when the string stops it still has some seconds after that so that you can fill up the gap from the attack which was slow you know what i mean so let's hear the attack again and 
and then you can do a let's see a low pass so now you have a low pass on the string and then you just did that tag and then and somebody somebody would actually add maybe some kind of reverb but the reverb is there already a little so we just leave it like that and then you can just reduce the string a little so it's like a pad now it's not a string so and then now we can play these <laughs> again maybe you want to take the string and put it let's say uh, I would like to put the string maybe somewhere okay I'll move it so we'll just group everything after so for now let's take the string here right the string section and then what you want to do is add uh, maybe a gross bit um, you mess with the volume with the volume part so maybe you want this one fourth and then just reduce it maybe a little more so it, it depends on how you want it to sound you can make it one over six so you can even have a lot of different feel to it one third you you decide you know. but i'll take it and put it on one fourth or you mess with the trends So now you have this type of sound into into my piano and um, the song is already sounding amazing and then this is like a beginners for people that are trying to learn this whole thing and you already have a nice thing if you have my sample pack you already have these and then now you can just put in these chords in between and that's that's the type of thing and then from there it's up to you what you add <laughs> And now, uh, one of the most important things, the log drum, right? So you come here. So you find the log drum. So here I'll paint DX10 and then let's find the log drum, right? So, so you have a log drum and then we will try to play the log drum for you. So now, because I already have like the chords to scale everything. So I'll just take off the sampler thingy. Uh, remember which key are we playing on let's go down we're playing on g right and then so now we can just delete this if we need this we'll come back to it so i took out the sampler there was the ghost notes i took them off because i want to see where the bass is so the bass line it's here there and there and there and then so it's on c so we're gonna put c and I say control Q. Uh, I think wait, let's put it back to step and then say control Q. And then I'll just click on it. Okay, fine. So I know we're on C, I know we on F sharp. And then I know we on A. I can take A lower and then I know we're sitting on E. So C, D, E. So great. So we are. We have these ones, and then now it's just how you gonna play these ones, and then you'll be good. And then let's hear. I'll try to increase the volume for now, and then do the decay a little, and then I'll come back to other stuff, and then let's hear. I'm on the right key. 
So I guess he doesn't want me to go too high. We can just come here. So I'm just making it easy first. Um, and then from them, I would just mess with it more, you know. think this so we're supposed to put it on a I'll just do this put it on a and then we, then we do this and, uh, for now just want to hear how it sounds and then we can mess with it later <laughs> I'm just showing you what you can do, you know, when you make a piano, and then you already have a nice sounding um, song. So this is like for beginners, for people that are still learning how to get from A to B. And then I've just given you uh, what you can do to to actually achieve what I just achieved today, and then from there you can actually move up. So it's like the beginners. Uh, way of making my piano and then what else can I add uh, you probably need a snare so uh, just find you this, the, the elements that normally are being used in my piano and then let's see uh, Matia is getting to DJ Odyssey pack I'm a piano and so drums and then let's say snares Uh, some crazy snares in here so you can choose whichever one works for you and then yeah so let's say i use a different pattern okay let me use this pattern the first pattern so when you get this project you only get it with two patterns and you can see what you can do you know what i mean i'm giving this frp for free so now i was saying okay it's only one bar but i'll show you how maybe so with a snare i normally like go four bars so it can be different but for now we're just doing something like a beginner's trial and then we move on to the next and on to the next and then we'll keep on making this type of beat so yeah so you will have a snare going <laughs> sounds good doesn't it and like you have a nice snare and then you already have a, have a lock drum in it um let's see if we can't add anything extra um so for an extra thing i would like to just go into gms for now i don't know if i'm gonna find what i'm thinking i'm gonna find but let's see so we are in gms and then we'll try to get some type of a melody um that would work this is the part where i was supposed to have uh 
that sample I think that shows me the scales where I'm at and all that but let's see if we can do anything uh, we don't want the bass on we want something that's gonna be uh, let's see how this uh, yeah I don't know how these sound so I'll just choose one for now just So you can have something like this. So I'll put this here, put this here, and then put it here, and then, and I'll just grab it until the end. sounds good but let's see if we can find any more sounds here. So for now, I'll just leave it like this. And you have uh, a simple Lama piano beat that people would actually say, oh, this is dope. And then, yeah, I think that's it for today. Please subscribe to my channel if you like what I just did. This is like a beginner's uh, tutorial for people that are still learning how to do Lama piano. And then download my pack so that you can be able to make the drums that I did. Again, please subscribe. And I'm out. Yo. Peace, man. I love you so much for watching. And then thanks for 1 point something K subscribers. So I'm probably going to be reaching one, like 2K in, in a few days. And I really appreciate you guys for that. And thank you. And this is it.